Hey everybody, Dark Mario Luigi here and welcome back to more Let's Play of The Legend of Zelda, Majora's Mask. Last time, we uh, turned back into Young Link and uh, got another heart piece. And uh, today, we are going to do a few side quests here around uh, Lockdown and hopefully around uh, Termina Field. Because the area outside of Lockdown is actually called Termina Field, so yeah. There's actually some really cool thing I want to show you. It's kind of hidden. I guess some people would like to be stuck as to know where this thing is, but if you uh, go over here and just jump like this and uh, do this crazy jump and then jump like that and You'll be over here. And what this thing, the, there's a treasure chest right there. And inside it is 100 rupees. There are actually two of these chests. And for some reason, I cannot, for the life of me, remember where that other 100 rupee chest is. So what I'm gonna do now is I am going to uh, go deposit these rupees because I think after you deposit these rupees you will get that prize that you was talking about. So let's deposit. Yes, I want to deposit. Okay. 99. Yeah, what's up? This, you've already saved up 200 rupees. Well, little guy, here's your special gift. Take it. Okay. We got an adult wallet. Alright. See, doesn't it hold more room than your old one? Fill it up and bring it on to deposit. All right, so now we have a bigger wallet. So now what you can do is uh, you can also withdraw rupees, which you can take the rupees from the brick and make and have it yourself. And, uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. I'm just gonna take about 50 because there's a couple mini games we're gonna play. Yes, I'm gonna use it wisely. By the way, I'm gonna go over uh, here and here. Here we are at the swordsman school type thing. And this training center, this center has friendly polite. Friendly polite 24 hour one on one training that will noticeably improve your sword skills. From now on until the end of car the carnival. Join at a special discount. So when you'll try it, you can also you can do two things. You can do the novice course, which just explains how to do your attacks in the expert course, which does nothing, but you have to like hit a certain amount of uh, these cardboards. Uh, yeah, it's just, it's just a practice session. Cut down the 10 logs using the highly difficult techniques. If you score a perfect 30 points, you'll should be taught all the secrets. Have you prepared? All right, and uh, don't expect me to get this on the first try. Just go. <laughs> I'm not the best at this. And I may have already failed this. All right. Yes, there we go. Hmm, impressive. I must give you something. Here. Yep, we got another piece of heart. Unbelievable. Cherish it well. Uh huh. I should cherish a, cherish a heart. Great. Now, there's something that you can do. It's not really uh, required. Go come in here. 
This is the lottery shop. I'm not exactly sure what this does because I've never really done it before. Would you like the chance to buy your dreams for 10 rupees? Pick any three numbers, and if those are picked, you'll win 50 rupees. It's only for the first person. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much what you do. Just, uh, pay 10 rupees, then, uh, pick three cards, and then if you win, you'll get 50 rupees. I'm not really gonna do it. Too bad, now's your chance. Well, I'm probably never gonna do it. I guess it's good if you're really lucky for, like, grinding rupees a lot. Let me just check. Really? Uh, uh, of course you are. Of course you would be in the morning. Alright. Um, uh, what to do? What to do? Oh, man, I can't really, uh, think of anything other than, uh, heading out. Um... Uh. Huh. I wonder what I can do. Seriously, I can't think of anything that I can do. Well, you know what? I am actually... Oh yeah, there's something I can do. Yeah, of course. We're gonna head outside to meet a field. Because there's a couple of things we can do here. It's now that we are a human, even though this will we'll let do. Stop right there! I have you some errand in the swamp. It is dangerous outside in the town wall, so you I cannot allow a child like you to. Sword! My apologies, sir. It was wrong of me to treat you like a child. Well, I am pretty much one. <laughs> the stuff in the swamp and the wolf hole lies in this direction. Be careful. Uh huh. Anyways, here we are in Termina Field. This is our basic overworld, and there's uh, quite a few hard pieces we can get here, but a lot of them we can't really get now. So what I am going to do is, if you run around those, that grass over there, you'll eventually go into a hole. And I'm pretty sure one near the grass is, yep, right here. And as you can see, there's this thing that's from Ocarina of Time that you actually have to fight. You don't really have to fight them in uh, Ocarina of Time. And oh man, oh man, oh man. Uh. Uh. Okay. Keep hitting him. Uh. All right, we did it. Awesome. Open the treasure chest to get another heart piece. Awesome. Uh, actually, what's in this grass? Yeah, rotate, rotate, the control so you can press B to do a spin. It's actually, at this point in the game, it's a lot more powerful than the one in the beginning of Ocarina of Time. Okay. Now, here's something I wanted to show you. Uh, uh, okay, see that bird over there? You do not want to go faster, because if you do, there is a good chance that he's gonna um, steal your stuff. Not all your stuff, but one of your important things. So, yeah, you just really do not want to go near him. Wait, what did I do? This? I know there's a lot more stuff we could do in uh, the count but you know what I'm actually gonna head off to the first area so 
Yeah. Let's go straight. Straight. Yeah, it, yeah, as you can see, you don't really need it, any, like, of that Stone of Agony or something to, uh, you can still hear the, you still have it in this game, you still hear, like, the, the rumbling thing where like, the, where there are, like, holes and stuff. Uh-huh. Apparently now, apparently Tattle spots something. Looks like the Skull Kid. Oh, I remember this. Tail and I drew this with Skulkin when we first met him. Ah, uh, he told us that he had been fighting with his friends and that they all had left him alone. Uh huh. It's raining. I don't not know what point in time Link is like. I don't know where Link is at this point in time. This is like way before Majora's Mask started. I don't know when this. I would assume after Ocarina of Time. Why? Are they scared or something? I never really actually got that. I don't know if he's angry or if he's just cold. I would assume he's angry. And, uh, he's like, I'm gonna eat you! <laughs> and now, they're playing together. Great. <laughs> Great. They're drawing that now. The little two dotted lines with stuff that the fairies. I'm I'm sure it was because he was always playing tricks. No, but so nobody wanted to play with him. But to do what he did just because of that. Uh, adult abuse, I guess. <laughs> Not really sure if there is one. Once he got his power. Uh huh. So that's the backstory behind how the Skull Kid got the Majora's Mask. Okay, so now that we've done that, we can pretty much head on in inside. Uh, oh yeah, there's one thing we can do here. Get these jellies, you get the stuff inside them. You can either, you can either be certain things like hearts right there or magic. And we want to go inside the tree. But the thing is, there's bats all or bird type things all around here. And I'm actually going to show you a transforming thing. It's kind of scary, but uh, you're only going to see this uh, first time. Yeah. Isn't that scary? Anyways, what we want to do is... Uh, Shoot the bird with the bubble. Alright. Oh yeah, I killed you. Is there any more? Uh, I think I, I can make that. Please tell me I can make it. All right, we got another heart piece. This is awesome. Oh, apparently there's a hole. Let's check that out. It's most of the holes in this game, except for the ones that have heart pieces in them. They're really not special. Apparently we got a dagger stick. Apparently in this game, the dagger stick sticks looks a lot better, a lot longer than the one in Ocarina of Time. And there, we got a red ruby. All right. And... One thing we're 
gonna do is we're gonna yeah, you press the button that the Jackie Master can flip twice and you will skip that scary same thing. You wanna blow up the balloon that uh, tingles on. Oh yeah, I simply forgot to mention the game is this tingle. It's so horrible, especially in Wind Waker. Ah! Thank you! <laughs> yeah, you pretty much just the same thing all over again. Alright, we're gonna buy the Woodfall map. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Say your little thing. No. Ah. No. Ah. Seriously. I just want to leave. Anyway, here we're entering the southern swamp. Oh. Okay, yeah. There's a poisonous water everywhere. Well at a certain point. And yeah, this is our first area. What we're gonna do is I'm gonna start off here after I hit this bird statue. Statue. There's a re reason for doing this, which I'm pretty sure we might figure it out next time. So if you like this part, please subscribe, comment, and be sure to comment and give a thumbs up. And if you want updates on when videos are gonna be posted, and if they're not, be sure to check out my Twitter account in the description box below. And I'll see you guys next time for more Let's Play of The Legend of Zelda, Majora's Mask. This is Dark Matter Luigi, signing out. Peace!